This video covers the setup for AWS SDK to perform instant status checks. AWS provides resource material to accomplish this. First, download the Visual Studio's AWS Toolkit. When you open the Visual Studio's application, you may get the launch page for AWS SDK. If you don't, you can also find the Explorer under the View option on your toolbar. To add a profile, you will need IAM credentials. Sign in to your AWS console to find IAM under AWS services. Select user from the menu, then add a new user with default as the username. The user will be added to a group that may need to be created. Once you've successfully added the user, you will be brought to a page where you can locate your user details. Save these, otherwise you will need to create new credentials later. Enter in your IAM user information to Visual Studios to create the profile. You can find your account number under the My Account menu option it will be labeled account ID. The following code should work with the default IAM user using your preferred region. Create a new project. Go to Tools to install the NuGet packets. Install AWS SDK Core and AWS EC2. Next, you can add a form and a class to your project. I will trigger the event using a button and display the results in a table. Be sure to add your dependencies to your code. The form will use an instance ID that will be passed to the class. The class performs the status check, then returns these values back to the form. When you run a status check, you should retrieve details about active instances.